is a Canadian, and not just a Canadian, but a CF-18 demonstration pilot. The so the, the back story on this, this guy recorded this for him. It's sort of a gift. It was a gift. I, I wish... I just, you know, I don't know. Is it just me? Is something just a little... I, well, I don't know. What do you think? Maybe a little off? What do you think? Rob's the musician. Kingston Trio guy. Okay, well, look, we've... We've... We've played it. We've played it. 1950s Jets. Gonna crank it up and have a little fun, fun, fun here with Scratch and Wired. Greg Collier. Look at this. Locked in. Two vintage military kids. How cool. Jet, of course, made its way through the 60s, into the 70s, then with a few other countries, the 80s, and with the Canadians, and Greg got both of these jets as uh, ex-RCAF jets, the Canadair built ones by license, right. and uh, they flew them until the 1990s, oh, come on. almost into the 2000s. Bolivia held on to a long, uh, 8,700 or so built, but as you mentioned, Rick, the, the idea of the Canada Bill, they were built under license, so Lockheed gave the plans and the tooling to Canada Air, and they built some, even Japan built some of them, of the, of the, the 8,750 or so that were built. The formation flying that we're seeing today is really a challenge, because especially in an airplane that does not spool up and change speeds as well, Scratch attitude, airspeed, and heading to move him and his wingman through each and every maneuver safely. But Scratch, he doesn't know where the ground ends and the sky begins. He just knows where he is. To fly it, and Scratch's job would be to miss. We're going to see some closure rates here of what, nearly about uh, eight, 900 miles an hour, do you think? We'll see the radio flash. Okay, we're a little further out, and that's that's tight. That's tight. I'm gonna, I'm gonna need to sit down here for a second. I'm all tight. I'm gonna swing it back around here again. The duet will do a nice routine when they're in front of the crowd, but it's the turnaround maneuver that allows Greg Collier and Rob Mitchell to do twice the number of hits. He has such a passion for it. He really and invested in it, bought three of them. The trainer version of it, the TF and then the, the T-33. Watch what Greg and Scratch do to help slow this airplane down. They will touch down, the nose will come down, sort of. Watch the canopy come open, three, Two, one, see if he pops it. Come on, Bubba. A little yeah. fast yet, he's gotta wait. Yeah. There, there it goes. Yeah, there it works like it, it works like a speed, speed break. break. Exactly. I love it. I don't know if that was Greg or Scratch, but they did a nice job. Pretty confident about his speed, so he's like mess up his hair too. Well, and that you know what? There it is. There it is. <laughs> I'm just saying, hey, listen, a big thank you to uh, to all of our sponsors for making today happen. We just couldn't do it without it.